Hi what's up everyone, in this video we're going to talk about the top best laptops for computer science students you can buy on Amazon. This list is based on my personal opinion and research and lists them based on quality features and pricing. If you want more information and updated pricing on the products mentioned be sure to check the links in the description below. As we all know, without a decent laptop, a student pursuing a major or a degree in computer science will not get by. Although coding, learning programming languages, principles, submitting tasks on time, creating projects, etc. will be the primary requirements for most students, students could also do with some extracurricular breathers, such as occasional gaming. Finding a laptop can seem easy at first, but with so many options in the market. It becomes a little difficult in finding the one that is tailored to your needs. The difficult task is not finding a good laptop but finding an appropriate one, the one which is neither overpowered nor underpowered. The task could seem incredibly challenging with a multitude of choices available on the market today, but we have considered all the potential variables in this guide that will help you decide on a laptop that would fit your needs and requirements. I have prepared this video guide for the best laptops for computer science students to give you the ins and outs to help you make the right choice. So let's get started. 5 colon Surface Pro 7 the Surface Pro isn't a good choice if you are a developer already but it's probably one of the best choices if you are still a student. OneNote with the Surface Pro will replace your entire library of books along with all of your school supplies if you are willing to give the stylus a try, so you can take notes directly on it as if it were a real notebook. Even mathematicians and graphic design students use the stylus. OneNote helps keeping every note slash PDF file you have neatly organized for you to easily access quickly. In computer science, this means being able to read documentation or look up a piece of code slash function quickly. Another reason why it made it to the list is the price. It's not cheap but it's configurable to tons of different specs which you can adjust to your budget. Again you have to make sure to grab one with 8GB RAM, the rest will take care of itself. If you must know what the difference between what you can do with each here they are. 4 colon Microsoft Surface Pro the Microsoft Surface Pro is called the best 2-in-1 device that Microsoft has ever produced and why shouldn't it be called that way? It offers so many features at a very reasonable price. Certainly a top pick when looking for the best laptop for computer science students. With an enticing resolution of 2736 x 1824 and a 12, 3-inch display, Surface Pro is admittedly identical to Surface Pro 4. The touchscreen has however been greatly enhanced. Besides this, relative to Surface Pro 4, the edges are more rounded. The improved hinge angle for better studio mode is one more difference that speaks loudly. The laptop is covered with Alcantara fabric, which makes it a bit unfriendly to be placed on the lap. With specs boasted by Microsoft Surface, you shouldn't expect heavy performance from it as compared to a high end laptop. However, it does top the list in 2 inch ones available out there. The model which I'm reviewing comes loaded with 256GB SSD and 8GB RAM. Moreover, it contains a GPU of Intel Iris and HD graphics with a 7th Gen Core i5 processor Microsoft Surface wins the portability contest. It is super portable and lightweight. I mean carrying 1.7 pounds, 0.8 kilograms, around, and that too is slim, 0.33 inches, as this device is not a drag is it. The Surface Pen is one of Microsoft's biggest features offered on this laptop. It has been made more susceptible to strain, which for illustrators is a fantastic thing. So, if you'd like to do that along with finishing your studies, it should work just fine for you. For typing, the ergonomic keyboard has been styled to accommodate comfort and convenience. However, for connecting devices, there is only one USB 3.0 port, a mini display port, a micro SDXC card reader, and a mic slash headphone jack. Microsoft has managed to make room in this model for a 20% bigger battery than the previous models. This indicates nothing but an improvement in the general timing of the battery. However as opposed to the claims made by the manufacturers, it lasts between 6 and 7 hours. 3 colon H.P. NV13 We tested out the HP NV13 which comes with 4K high resolution touchscreen, an Intel Core i7-8565U processor, 16GB SD RAM and a 512GB SSD accompanied by an NVIDIA GeForce MX250 graphics card. For its sophisticated and stylish looks, the Envy lineup of HP laptops is renowned and the latest version does justice to the current lineup. When it comes to simple aesthetics, the Envy will bring almost any top-end laptop down. This laptop can compete with almost any compact laptop out there in terms of size and weight, weighing only about 2.8 pounds and having a width of just about 0.6 inch, this portability is particularly useful for students who want to travel small. The 4K high resolution gives out a very startling vibe with sharp and bright colors oozing out of the screen. 
The 4K touchscreen is responsive and the feel of touch is vivid and it makes the whole experience of using stock drawing apps like Snip and Sketch a whole lot more exciting. This experience can come in handy if you're using wireframing tools to plan the UI slash U.X. Of your application and don't want to go through the hassle of using a pen tablet before you proceed to write code. The combination of the i7 8565U CPU, 16GB SD RAM, and a 512GB SSD will create a cakewalk for your heavy performance use. While debugging and compiling code, you could run a bunch of Chrome tabs and watch your favorite movie in 4K all at the same time. All this, coupled with good battery life, quality speakers, and critical safety features, makes it an excellent option for students of computer science. 2 colon Acer Predator Helios 300. Due to its increased price, owning a powerful laptop with high-end specs might seem far-fetched to a computer science student, but with Acer Predator Helios 300 series in the scene, that won't be the case anymore. At the cost of a mid-range laptop, this is a potent computer. The back panel of the screen is metal, as is keyboard and palm rest area, the screen bezel and bottom are plastic. This makes the laptop look aesthetic and since it's a high-performance machine, it keeps the bottom from microwaving your lap. The display, on the other hand, is enough to wow anybody. The screen is rated at about 300 nits. It's perfectly visible outside in daylight, the contrast and color gamut is very effective and pleasing to the eye. So if your assignments require you to code for long hours at a stretch, at least you won't have an unpleasant experience. Thanks to the 256GB Xenves SD on this machine, this machine is capable of running high-end games such as Fortnite, Overwatch, and the apps all at the same time, Complex programming with tools such as TensorFlow and Shogun run smoothly, enabling you to save the micro details of your precious project. The GPU can take just about everything you can possibly throw and add it on the most insane settings and you won't notice any performance problems. You can try your luck with the most insane game or programming setup, and it won't fail to astonish you. One of the highlights of this laptop is that it is not entirely plastic and metal parts, but it also has an exceptional cooling system that allows you to work together for hours without having to worry about overheating it. The shortcomings, however, are that this laptop has a very limited battery life for heavy use it manages to maintain continuous use for only 5 hours, so if you're looking at longer portable use hours, this may not be your best bet. 1 colon Asus FX504 The Asus FX504 also comes with a 15.6 inch IPS display which has quite large bezels compared to the above Asus ZenBook. The body of the laptop is mostly made out of plastic which is very rigid but the top panel flexes a lot which might concern some people. The FX504 comes with 8GB DDR4 RAM and 256GB SSD, which in my view, is very decent. The processor is very strong inside the system i.e. the Intel Core i7-8750H. It has 6 cores and 12 threads, which does a pretty good job of handling any kind of operation. The GPU offered on this machine is GTX 1050T which is decent for its pricing and it can help you play games at decent frame rates. Even if you aren't a gamer, this graphics card will surely help you run any graphics demanding applications at ease. In my view, the port range of this laptop could have been better. An Ethernet port, HDMI, 1 USB 2.0 and 2 USB 3.0.0 can be found on the right side. There is just a Kensington lock on the right side. On this unit, there is no SD card reader or USB Type-C, which could make customers dissatisfied. You'll find only a red backlit feature on this keyboard. There is no RGB backlit feature offered on this laptop. This is another con people might see on this laptop. Compared to its rivals, the battery life on this laptop is very low. And when using it for any small activities, such as searching or watching movies, it can only last a little over 2-3 to three hours. When you are looking for a laptop with a decent battery life, this may not be the right option. So guys this was the video about the best laptops for computer science students best laptops for computer science students. All the links are given in the description, do check them out. If you enjoyed the video be sure to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more videos. Thank you.